Hey Legacy Traders, it's Tim Key with Option Legacy, helping you build a legacy through trading. Hey, I wanted to take a quick few moments and share with you guys my own personal synopsis of the markets. So let's go ahead and hop over there and look into the S&P 500. So this is the S&P 500. We saw in January of this year just what they called a melt up, just chugged up like it's never chugged before. But what has it done since then? Well, I wanted to kind of draw it out for you guys. Let's see. And see if you don't see what I'm going to see. So let's make it blue bright. And we're going to put it big fat dots. So had this... Down day. Okay. Had that down day, and what is it created? It's created a double top or an an M pattern. But look at where we're at today. So we have that M pattern. Do you see that? You know, M stands for misery, meaning that it should continue down. However, we're right here at this 20 day exponential moving average, that green line there, green line. Let's just zoom in a little bit more and you'll see we are right on top of that. So what can happen? Tell me if you see this type of pattern. happening right here do you see that rectangle pattern so we had our big drop off of January and February 2nd 5th and 8th and then we bumped up hit that high right here came down hit a double top which shows some resistance right around this point and then now we have our M pattern to the downside with the consolidation here and this green candle body right at the 20 day exponential moving average. So that thicker green line is a 20 day exponential moving average. So what, what do we suggest from here? From standing from a technical analysis standpoint, if this thing cannot cross and close above the 20 day exponential moving average, then we should expect bears to take over and capture this market. However, if this thing can cross above the 20 day moving average, we could possibly see a move to the upside and see the rawr, bulls are however a bull sounds bulls take over inside this market. So guys, tomorrow's a pivotal day in this on from a technical analysis standpoint to see if we can cross that 20 day moving average or if we'll continue to bounce down inside that consolidation rectangle and possibly continue even further down inside that M pattern with the double top and move to the downside. So guys, let me know what you think. Comment below and I will see you on the other side.